Hello everyone and welcome. So in this tutorial I will show you how to make a double jump effect for the player. So by default if I go and play and the player is doing just one jump okay when I hit the space bar. So let me do the double jump effect. So I will do this inside C++. Let me go to the IDE. Now let me do this. Let me declare a bool variable. Let me copy this line and call this bool b first jump and by default it will be true the first jump is true okay we rename this for example anything except countdown and this will be true okay so the b first jump is equal to true now let me go and create this function will be double jump okay so let me generate the definition for that and this will be called by this okay so when the enhanced input component system bind an action of jump input when I press the space bar please call this double jump before it was like this let me show you it was like this a character for example and it was calling the jump function okay before it was calling this that but I need to make my own function which will be this double jump okay so when it called this now it's checking for the first time now if it's B first jump if is this the first jump for me so if it's true set B first jump equal to false and now call the a character itself the jump function okay now when it's true by default it's true set the first time you call this function is calling is this a true okay set that to false and make the player jump and next time it will be false okay because i set that to false so i will in fact now i will launch the character from f vector and i will pass 0, 0.0 f on x because i need just the z axis 0, 0.0 f and i will you can initialize that as a variable but i will do this quick as a 500.0 f okay and pass as a false and override the z which will be true okay so this will be like that so the first time you call double jump is asking is this the first jump yes it is set that to false and jump the next time it will be false it will call the launch character and will launch that so now it's fine okay the next time you will ask double jump it's keeping that false okay so I need a function that reset that and the nice thing we already have that inside the character itself okay so inside virtual virtual and it's a void I believe on landed on landed come on on landed come on there you are landed as soon the player has been landed on the floor please make that bool variable back to true okay so I will say B first jump is equal to true okay so when the player when the player for example he jumping and when he hit the ground this function on landed will be called and reset that the first jump so the next time when I call double jump please do this and the next time it has been false do that okay so let me compile now it has been compiled successfully so let's go and play and test that so let's hit play now it's let me hit the space bar now it's 
it's, it's, it's the first jump let me go to do this if I hit the space uh, space bar twice one two for some reason it's not working let me restart the editor and compile again so after I have uh, close the engine sometimes it doesn't work so I close the engine and compiled the source code my, my code from build and build the solution and reopen the engine and it will be fine so if I go now and play now if I hit the space bar twice one two it will do this double jump one two it will launch the character like this okay So now if I keep hitting the space bar, it will keep going me up, keep launching the character. So it's by default. Let me close this and go back on this. And basically it's saying on trigger. So let me go instead of a trigger. Let me do this on started, please. Not on triggered. Okay. And let me now build the solution please so the changes I made is on a started because when you say triggered it's doing that on tick so it's keep firing that on tick so I need to do that just once just once okay so on started please do the double jump and if it's the first time it's yes set that to false and jump the character the next time I will call this immediately it will launch the character but instead of 500 I give it this 1500 okay so I have increased that value so let me go back to the engine and play now if I play and hit the space bar twice one two it will launch the character double jump okay so this double jump okay now when he landed he go back to true first jump and so on okay so this is how you can make a double jump one two this is a double jump effect okay so this is about that so first of all you, you make a bool variable call it's a, is this a ver first jump by default it's true and call make your own function called double jump so when you bind that on jump on that key and this is super important you need that you, you need to make that on a start okay not on a trigger call double jump and double jump will call is this the first time first jump yes please is the first time make that to false and jump the character next time immediately as soon as I, I do the space bar please launch the character because this has been set to false and go to that state okay and when the player has been landed and let me go scroll up where it is landed there you are and when the player hit the floor reset back b is first jump to true so now i can jump twice okay so this is how you can make a double jump effect inside unreal engine 5 with c plus plus